Hello, hello. Welcome back to another episode of Compound Chaos. I know I'm not your typical host, sadly. Um, Mike and Tracy, aka Mom and Dad, have decided to do something a little different. And they took a vacation. Lucky them. So, <laughs> so while Sid and I are holding down the fort, Sid really, really, really wanted to get a project done in the house. And I did not argue with that because, as you can see, there's about a foot of snow out here. There's Winnie. And as beautiful as it is, it's not all that fun to work in. And a lot of what we need to get done cannot be done in the snow. So, we are working inside this weekend. Oh well. The project at hand is putting in new flooring. The living room, the, well, what we'll be doing is the living room, but the kitchen and front room will also be done later on. I think we'll do another video for that probably. I don't see why not. So Sid and I will be tackling the living room. We already took care of some of the prep work. Um, we did not film it. I don't know, sometimes that stuff can be kind of boring, sorry. So we ripped out the carpeting. Um, we ripped out the pads underneath. We got rid of all the staples and the nails. We swept, we vacuumed, we made sure it was nice and clean for us because that's the last thing we want is any of the floorboards to buckle just because of one little sliver of plywood. We uh, took care of all the measurements ahead of time so that way we could figure um, what our stagger needed to be and the width of the edge boards. So we got that covered.
so a little update we are about a third of the way done um, at about 1.30 last night Sid and I realized hey we haven't eaten dinner yet um, my brother came home with McDonald's and we both said alright we're stopping and we're going to get food um, I'm if you're watching this I'm sorry the pillows are not correct yet I will fix that later anyways this is as far as we got as you can see we've gone through about 12 boxes and hey Winnie Although it doesn't seem like a lot, they they feel like a lot, putting them in. Let's just put it that way. This is, well, don't mind that. This is what we're trying to tackle today. We still gotta move some of that stuff out of the way so we can get there. So far, everything seems to be looking nice. Uh, everything lays flat and the seams are, well, seamless. Um... I will say that at about two or three rows, um, we quickly realized that there was a couple things not working quite well, or at least not fitting together quite well, so uh, I went back and I redid those first couple rows, and they fit together a lot nicer, and it worked out really, really well. It put us back about an hour or so, which is fine, because in reality, as long as it's done well, the time is fine. Once we get in the groove, we're decently cruising. Uh, Sid does really well with making the cuts and making sure that the measurements are correct. And then I go along each strip and pound them in and make sure they're all put together nicely. So we got a good system going and I think it's paying off. I don't know. The real judges will be here in about a, another week. But yeah. So, day two continue doing what we were doing and uh, we'll see how far we get today.
come this far we've only got about a third of it left and even at that it's not that much with that chunk cut out but we've come to the most fun part this lovely piece here gotta get the rest of the old carpeting out from underneath I think you can kind of see it there so I've been digging underneath here trying not to split much but it's big enough of a gap underneath that we can slide the pieces. So I just want to clean out what's there. And then, hi Smith. Like this one here, get out of the way. This one here is clean. This one here is ready to go. I'm gonna bump it up to the step here. But this guy still has some carpet in it, so clean, clean, clean. Just gotta vacuum it up, and we've got the fireplace, which isn't too bad with this bead square. That'll make quick work. Just making sure the cuts are nice and precise. But uh, we've gone through about double the boxes we started with, maybe even triple. What is that? Two, four, six. 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22. 22 sound right? Yeah. About 22 boxes. So, not bad. It's coming together.